What's going on guys, Balkan Architect here and I'm very excited to present to you a new course that I'm doing this week and it's going to be another advanced Revit family course and I'm going to be covering the topic of doors in Revit for this course. So uh, these types of courses that I'm creating are going to be kind of one of those in-depth courses where I cover all of the aspects on how to create a door family in Revit. So this is uh, the door family that I'm going to be created. Now it looks uh, relatively simple. It's got uh, just the basic elements, but they go in depth into all of the elements, all of the visibility settings, how to make it different in different uh, uh, levels of detail, also how to set up these detail lines so they're fully parametric whenever you change uh, the family it should kind of change with it so if I change it make it bigger it changes with it also the, the, these uh, swing lines uh, opening doors doors that are appearing open and floor plan and then if you go into 3d it appears closed that's how it should look like also, I go through all of the settings, how to create this door frame that's actually a bit more complex, how to lock everything in place so it actually changes when you change the thickness of the wall. So if you make it thicker, it's going to change with it. It's not going to mess it up. Also, when you make it a lot thinner, it's going to work there as well. Also, all of the other parameters must work with that. Then I go here into the family types dialog. I show you how to create several types uh, in different sizes and different materials. Also how to set up some of the uh, material parameters, how to set up additional parameters with formulas. Also here uh, under identity data, I make some changes. So uh, when we load this into an actual project, so here uh, we've got a couple of these doors loaded into a Revit project. So you can see over here, we've got a couple of doors just uh, standing uh, next to each other. This one is the white one and this one is a birch wood door. So maybe if I go here to realistic, uh, this is what it looks like. So one is white, one is birch. I'm going to be, is, I've set this family up in such a way so when we create a door schedule, it looks like this. So we've got this image next to our door. So you can see here it says white door, but actually you also have an image so you can view what that door will look like uh, kind of in real life. Uh, once you uh, set it up with and render it. So uh, you you will learn how to load some images in and how to set them up in a correct way so they can be used in these Revit schedules. Also how to set up all the width and height parameters as well as the, uh, the count and stuff like that. Okay, so if you want to learn everything there is to know about creating these advanced uh, Revit doors that can be actually used for some manufacturers. So if you find manufacturers that need doors, you can offer your services as a Revit door modeling expert. So that's what this course is going to be covering. And if you want to check it out, it's going to be up on my Patreon. So first a link in the description. It's one of my advanced courses on Patreon. I've already got a bunch so far. This is the ninth course I'm doing. These are all of the ones that I've done so far. So if you want to get access to all of those courses, as well as the ones I'm going to be doing in the future, I do one advanced course each week. So just subscribe there for only $15 a month you will get access to all of those uh, one hour advanced courses as well as this one. This one is one hour as well. And if you just want access to the project files, all of the families, stuff like that, and all of my other families, I've got like 200 families so far, maybe even more like 300, uh, then you can become an advanced uh, Balkan Architect uh, member or sorry, premium Balkan Architect member. And that's uh, just access to all of the project files without the advanced courses. And that's only five dollars a month and whenever I create new projects in Revit I load those uh, family files or those pro Revit project files to that uh, Patreon page so you can check it out. So again as I said first link in the description if you want to check it out and if you want to learn about families in Revit, about doors or some of the other courses I've done so far. Okay, so that's pretty much it for today. And in a couple of days, I'm, I'll be coming back with a, another regular uh, tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share this video. And I'll see you back. I'll see you in a couple of days. Have a nice day.